Hey guys, what's going on? It's October EMP. Today I'm going to be showing you my strings from Cydia. What this allows you to do is edit and change any string in your iPhone that you want. Um, if you don't know what a string is, I'll give you a couple of examples. One is the slide to unlock. Another is the alerts you get when your phone is running low on battery or you miss a call or anything like that. Any kind of text on your iPhone or your iPod Touch or your iPad. And this works for all three of them. So I am going to show you guys how to use it. If you want to get it, um, just add the repo here and search my strings in Cydia and you guys can go grab that. Now I do recommend that you purchase this, um, but if you want to try it out um, before you purchase it, you guys can get it from the repo that I'm giving you. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to use this now. So how you, once you get it, you do have to go into Winterboard and activate it, but once you're all done activating it, just come into your settings and scroll down and it'll be right here with all your other jailbroken applications. So as you can see, right when you open my strings, it gives you a list of all these different sections of strings that are available. And you can also click all strings if you want to. Now, if you so you guys really kind of understand what I'm talking about, we'll go over here. Now, right now, I have my lock screen slide to unlock. I changed it to October EMP, and I'll show you guys what that looks like. All right, so as you guys can see right there on the bottom, it says October EMP instead of slide to unlock. So that is a string, so you guys know. As you can see, there's tons of other ones. I changed the slide to power off to shut down. Um, there's also slide to stop alarm. Now, these are just examples I'm trying to give you guys so you could understand exactly what a string is. I know a lot of you guys are going to already know, but for those who are new to jailbreaking and stuff. A lot of other good ones, um, you guys can go over here to uh, Downloads. And here's some other good ones that you probably know. Dismiss and Download Completed. You could change those to whatever you want to. Come over here to iDevices. You have you can change your iPod and i um, iPhone logos to something other than iPhone. Also, lock keypad. You can change this. You can change the OK button. You can change the Enter passcode, or you can change the Enter a new four digit. You can change it to whatever you guys want to. If you're if you use passcode lock on your lock screen, but there are tons and tons and tons of different ways. It's very easy to use, and like I said, I'll show you what it looks like in Winterboard. Go inside Winterboard here and go and select themes and right up here it'll say activate my strings and you're just going to want to check that off and then let your device respring and that's that. But that's really as easy, it's really that simple. It's changing strings used to be a lot more difficult um, than it is now, but luckily we got smart developers, people working on jailbroken iPhone stuff that really have made it a lot easier for us to completely customize our phones now, down all the way down to the strings, and that's very nice. It, it gives each iPhone or iPod Touch its own unique distinction. But that's it. I hope you guys liked the application. If you did, leave me comments below. Make sure to subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later.